Hi there, so in this video I'm just going to use a few languages to show you how you can update a field um, with a sort of search and replace in um, uh, um, Arches Pro. So let's just do Python first. So on the column you want to alter uh, the, the attribute you want to update. Click on Calculate Field, right hand mouse click. And here you can, you can in fact, let's say we were just going to reset the whole thing to something well city so i've got city area there so i could just sort of say hello for example and that will just update the whole column but what if you want to change something specific i.e search and replace well it's quite straightforward actually so um you can there's a command here for called replace so what you want to do is select what you want to um, work with so it's city area is what i want to change uh, it's dot replace so that's your search and replace and then you put the input string uh the, the search string and then the at the um output string so i could say change all the hellos back to play b which is the name of the place so you can see how you can put it straight into here you don't you know you, you don't need a code box that, that that's to do extra stuff and i'll briefly show that um but that will do a search and replace replace all hellos with play 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 b press apply you see there's hellos there and now they're all blaby uh, i haven't enabled undo so it's written straight to it i'm going to enable un undo just to um, uh, help things along so that's very simple but what about if we wanted we wanted a bit more complexity in there so then you you'd have a function so you'd say that um you'd, you'd have something i don't know replace my data and then the replace data would be would pass the city area you see so so now whatever's in the code block you can you can do stuff on so if i just define replace my data um, and it picks up something doesn't matter what it's called let's call it donut for um because <clears throat> that's as good a word as any um so it can be anything it's just the you, you know this is just going to have whatever city area is that's what's passed and then of course the colon and then the new val equal donut dot replace you see which i've demonstrated before and let's change so it's blaby at the moment so let's change the i don't know la to um, um xx okay um close quotes. let's do that and then just return that new valve but you can see because it's python i can do all sorts of stuff in there python is going to give you greater control and and sort of help with batch processing and all that sort of thing so it, it is a more sort of powerful way of going so now all the la's are going to be replaced with that sort of double x you see so so that's how you would do the python uh, you can either just you know put the whole replace in the um expression there and then in the code block you could um or in the code you could use code block and do something a lot more sophisticated okay let's let's go to arcade so um, actually if I click on up here I can undo or I can certainly remove all edits so let's just press that so it'll go back to that so I'm now in arcade with arcade um, I'll just I'm just going to copy and paste what I've done before so it's just like the labeling in Arches Online and all that stuff it's the same um, uh, approach you know you're going to return this uh, new value from my script above so what i'm doing is looking at the feature there if i just get rid of that i can double click you see and it puts it there so double equals to, to for, for the um uh, checking of that value uh single quotes for strings so now i'm looking for if the feature if this city area is blaby then change to changed by arcade otherwise keep it to what it is just return what it is at the moment actually let's just uh let's change that to wherever yeah because then um and we'll press save on that so so now wherever should remain as is and and i'm doing this because in arcade um obviously and with python as well and the others we can do this conditional statements you know if it's something then do something you can do the same in python as well so let's apply so that's arcade so you see it's all changed by arcade apart from that bottom one which it just remains um, as as it was so that's arcade let's just get rid of my edits 
let's change to VB script. So with VB script, VB script, uh, there's still the same sort of um, construction you can put in um, into this expression block because this, this is an expression you can you can build up quite a lot in here. Uh, you don't like I said before, you don't have to use the code block and maybe create a function. So um, what you could do is in here find um, replace. Yep, this, these helpers are useful. Use replace, replace city field. Uh, the city area field and then just follow it with what you want so let's um, find everywhere with maybe and for whatever reason make it all capitals for example you see and then it's then it's changed it's done the search and replace so that's pretty um, simple but you know the, the other one the other one is too the uh, um, Python one can be uh, note as well with the searching, you could you could also um, sort of search for hidden characters. So you could, I don't know, see a chart thirteen for example, and replace any um, carriage returns with uh, you know with eleven, you know, or, or whatever. So you can um, put in those uh, special characters as well. So so there's a load. Um, so certainly there's. Uh, lots of options there what about with model builder well model builder oh, I'll just discard these changes model builder is um, really just carrying on with the calculator so so with model builder let's go to uh, analysis and model builder and um, we can you know because this may be something you want to run frequently for whatever reason maybe it's tricky to change the data at source it's incoming from someone outside the organization or whatever so you and you know the same things are in there and um, so you can do some tidying here so to create this model here it's, it's sort of it's quite straightforward so you would just drag your table into here um, you know, that's the one of interest let's make it a bit bigger so you can see and then um, let's find the tool which is calculate field it's a data management tool okay so that and, and that and that automatically places um, the um, updated table um, end process in there when you, when you hold the mouse down in the middle each of an object that's how you get the arrows to make the connection so I go um, that information goes into there as an input table so that so I'm using this same pub sample you see uh, which is this um, into my model uh, I can now set this to what I want so I'm using the default um, you know the tool just as before so let's say city area and we'll use um, I don't know we'll use uh, the actual BB script one. So BB script and it'll change all of labies. And like I say, let's make it to capitals. So we could do other stuff in here, of course we can. Um, and then um, just say okay, you can validate that of course. I'm sure it's okay. Just press okay. Uh, and I get nice pretty colours. So um, I it means it's um, all kind of accepted, it's runnable. A big stuff will be grayed out where it's not runnable. Uh, like I say, you can press validate and then we could just run this and it will just run, it'll just execute. Yep. And this is called model model two in there. So let's rename this actually. Let's go to properties and um, let's do search replace. Yep, that's the name and we'll have the same label actually. Search replace demo. I uh, don't know why it's going into that. Um, TBX, but um, never mind. Let's just save this. So that that that's all in there. So now um, I don't think we know. So if we um, got some more input data, maybe it's just that one, and that one. So instead of you know pulling up calculate fields and stuff, we can just run the tool and just run it. And there you go it's updated the table i mean because it's a a model you could do more with it you know we could we could do some sort of 
scheduling on it and um, um, and it's tied into to this project of course there we go I hope you find that useful uh, a few ways to do search and replace thank you